Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Asad Yaqub and I am from Lahore, Pakistan and I teach IELTS here in Lahore. Now, in this video, I'm going to tell you how to calculate your bands in listening as well as in reading. I've got this little booklet with me. This is basically IELTS guide for teachers, right? So from this booklet, I'm going to tell you how to calculate your bands because you know commonly the students, they don't understand how to calculate their bands in listening as well as in, in reading. So let me tell you about your bands. As far as listening is concerned, for listening, if you have 16 correct answers out of 40, I'm sure you'll have more correct answers, then you'll be getting 5 bands. In listening, 16 correct answers will give you 5 bands and 23 correct answers will give you 6 bands in listening, academic or gender training. Now between 16 and 23 that is 5.5. Got it? Yes, exactly. So uh, let's go on. In listening, if you've got 30 correct answers, you will get 7 bands. Now between 23 and 30, that is 6.5. And if you want to get 8 bands in listening, then you should have 35 correct answers out of 40 in listening. Then you will be getting 8 bands. I know there are some of the students and they are always saying, I need 8 triple seven. 8 triple seven means 8 in listening and triple seven in other three modules. So for 8 in listening you need 35 correct answers and between 30 and 35 is 7.5 bands, between 23 and 30 is 6.5 bands and between 16 and 23 that is 5.5 bands. Is that clear? Good. Now let's go on. Academic reading and gender training reading both are different. The band score is different for academic reading as well as for general reading reading. So let me tell you about academic reading. Uh, if you've got 15 correct answers in academic reading, you will get 5 bands. Now those who want to get 5 bands only focus on section 1. And in all the other sections you can do the tukkas, we call them fluke. And then with fluke you can get 2-3 correct answers and then you'll be able to get 5.5 okay so in academic reading if your target is 5 bands you need 15 correct answers that means focus on section 1 if you want to get that and if you want to get 6 bands in academic reading then you need 23 correct answers 23 correct answers will give you 6 bands between 15 and 23 that is 5.5 bands and I'm talking about academic reading and if you want to get 7 bands in academic reading, then you should have 30 correct answers. In reading test, you should have 30 correct answers and that is going to give you 7 bands and between 23 and 30, that is 6.5, okay? And if you want to get 8 bands, then in reading, academic reading, you need 35 correct answers. If you have 35 correct answers in academic reading, you are going to get 8 bands. Got it? And between 30 and 35, that is 7.5. And if you want to get 9 bands, you should have 39 to 40 correct answers. 39 to 40 correct answers and that will give you five, uh, 9 bands actually. And between 35 to 40, you will be getting 8.5 bands. Is that clear? Now, I'm going to tell you about general training reading and the band description because for general training reading, band description is different. One band difference. In general training, if you're going to get 15 correct answers in general training test, you will get 4 bands. And in academic with 15 correct answers, you get five bands okay this is the difference uh, in general training reading if you score 23 correct answers in the reading test you'll be getting five bands and in academic reading with 23 correct answers you get six bands so there is a difference of one band uh, next we've got 30 correct answers in general training reading and you'll be getting six so with 30 correct answers you will get six bands and with 34 correct answers you will get 7 bands. Now those who are targeting 
8777 in general training in order to get 7 bands in reading they need 34 correct answers in general training reading and more than 34 is going to give you almost 7.5 and if you want to get 8 or 8 plus bands then you need 38 correct answers for that so this is the description of general training I hope you would have understood by now that if you want to get good bands how many answers should be correct for that if you like this video hit on the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel and you can share my videos with others as well and you should comment on this video as well at least in your comment you can write your wish wow that's a lovely idea in the comment of this video write your wish just write I wish to get eight bands I wish to get seven bands I wish to get whatever the band score you want and I will read your comment and I'll give you good luck okay I'll give you the ashirwad for that as well okay so just in the comment write your wish I wish to get or I will either wish or I will I will get seven bands I will get eight bands I will get eight triple seven I will get this and that and I will pray for you to get that bands not only pray but also I'll make videos for you to get uh, that band actually the videos will enable you to get that bands uh, I also teach IELTS online if you want to take my online IELTS classes my number is given you can contact me for that Asad Yaku wishes you all the best take care Allah Hafiz